Sheik. Yo. No, I kind of just better than going Wolf and Rob, honestly. That's just me. I mean, yeah. But most because are most because they're kind of represented compared to those two. Dude, I, I I don't understand why Kira goes Rob or goes Pit. I don't know either. I'm just gonna be honest. I have no idea. Oh wait, I think they might have called me. I'm Rob's busted. Sounds good. <laughs> you like in that case? Back to still commentary, I guess. <laughs> That's okay though. It's all good. It means I have to pull up Chad again. <laughs> I might get called soon as well. Looks like they're starting to call me. So it might be back to no commentary in a little bit unless someone steps up. I think Fro wanted to commentate earlier, but he was still in brackets, so he didn't. We'll see. Might get him. Might get him a little bit, but I don't know. Regardless, I'll be here for at least the very beginning of this match. I don't know how fast it'll be, but we'll see. But yeah, I've never, I've never seen this matchup ever, because I don't see like pin much in general. But I can see, I can see it could go either way. I kind of feel like this kind, I kind of feel like this might be an even matchup in some way, but who knows? I can't think of any strengths that any character would have against the other in particular here. Ooh, your combo's gonna have to move here at least. Yeah. Probably get punched that bear, but it's, uh, it's at least damage. Damage is damage. Yeah, they, I think I'm about to get called in a second. I don't know. I'm more concerned about that in the match right now. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Oh, speaking of devil, like I, like I mentioned earlier, we got Fro on the mic. <laughs> Hell yeah. Perfect timing then. So we got K9 Sheik versus Kira Flax Pit. Just by oh, the way. Oh wow, the roommates, right? I think, yeah, yeah, yeah. They play against each other all the time. You can hear me, right? Yeah, I can. I can. Cool. Might put your mic a little closer to your face though. Absolutely. I'm, I'm always quiet on these. Yeah. <laughs> That's a problem. That's what it is. I got roasted for some of my VODs at hat. <laughs> <laughs> be too quiet. Uh, let's see here. Yeah, K9's been playing a lot more of a secondaries lately, or maybe just having a nice rotation between uh, the Wolf, Sheik, and uh, Joker. And Joker? Ooh. I haven't seen his Joker at all. Oh, it's, it's, hmm. it's just been playing with Joker every now and then, especially if he plays, uh, I think, Charlie. He's way from your match. Okay, makes sense. How's hey. Twitch stream doing tonight? Just want to shout out y'all that are watching with us here on MSF. Sup, gamers. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's, no, that's nothing right there in this game. For sure. So right now, Kira's actually got the advantage. Just trying to get a little more extra credit here. No, there's oh. the yeah, over just cool. a bit right there. Yes, he's, he's, these two know each other very well. They've been playing against each other for a long time. So I don't know how this is going to go. But right now, it looks like, well, can't back in control. But I don't know. I don't know. We'll, we'll see. It'll probably flip a lot. Is what I'm trying to get at here. Absolutely. It's gonna flip it between both of them in terms of stage control, and it's gonna be a bit uh, a big war of attrition. Absolutely. You know, Pitt's a, a sword. He's able to use his disjoints to some degree and create space for himself and take up space. And K9 has to do a really good job of trying to see, like right there, doing the, the crawl to get in on Kira Flex. And here we go. Trying to take full advantage of getting that advantage state. Ledge trap opportunity right now. Nice mayor. Yeah, I think it's where we're gonna get most of our damage at this point. <laughs> this is like on the ledge or gain off of it. Absolutely, that's Chief's game plan. It's to keep you like stuck on this final third of the stage. It really is. Oh. Uh, Chief's a character that just really benefits if you have uh, really strong core fundamentals. Oh yeah. Game. Nice also, it's also a there. especially in this game you need like have a lot of you need have you need have a lot of combo knowledge. Like, you have no Chief's combo route especially in this game. You can't just like pick it, pick you up and do well like you could. I don't know if I'm gonna say like good smash. You have to practice like, the character. Yeah, you have oh. to practice a lot more. That sometimes, side B. Sometimes you just need incredible. a really fat side B right there. Sometimes you just gotta box. throw it out. So that was perfect timing. Let's see how much Kira can extend here on the second stock. Oh, it's looking dicey right now. Oh, Ooh. Kira was able. I thought to you had him there. Yeah, I know Kira was able to finish a ledge trap. Low pro profile to avoid. Aerials right there. Nice escape by K9. Very nice. Center. Let's see here. Both players are trying to 
really methodically move around their space. Both being very, very patient right now. Just trying to create sort of opening. Yep. Nice oh. Oh, wow. Was that it? Nope. No, never Not good. quite. Almost got the stage tech there, but. Or stage tech. Didn't even expect it. I, I didn't expect it either. No. That means that was a good mix up. Yeah. Oh. That was why it's in that way. Can okay. I make Cure <laughs> uh, Flex pay for that grab whiff? Nice little retreat there by Kana. A little small crawl to get to the right spot for that grab. Got the struggle of Sheik right now, though. <laughs> just getting that kill. Kira's like, you're not going to hit me with the projectiles right there. <laughs> uh, here's some arrow play by Kira. At this point, I think Kira's a little bit more just interested in tacking on as much damage as possible, not really looking for any particular setups. Most oh, definitely. Oh, never mind. There's oh, a there we go. Down tilt to fair. There, right there by the wily pit. Yeah, Kira's not overstaying oh. at all. Oh! That look at that direction. Sure, why not? <laughs> that was a nice down smash there by Kira Flex. I can kill just yes. is very close to securing this game one win. If he keeps his ledge wrap up, I think he's just got this straight up. Absolutely, Shasta. Oh. Oh, there we go. K9 escapes nice. right now. But it's getting desperate. He's got to take the stock, which he does. The fair off the side. OK. Wow. I guess that can kill now. It's so funny because <laughs> Sheik's moves don't really have a lot of violent knockback. So when it finally gets to that percentage, it's just really funny. It's like, oh, stock's ended. Yeah, suddenly. <laughs> Who knew, oh, really? Oh, wow. that's a tech. That was a nice. I thought he might not be able to tech that, honestly. That was but a game-saving tech by K9 right there. Oh, yeah. Oh, nice detail placement. Nice bouncing fish. fish combo. Oh, and there oh, it is. Man, the oh, steal my it. goodness. Oh my God! He just stole that one from Kira Flex. That was a, that was a steal. Kira had that Oof. one. That's that's unfortunate. K9 might be the real Phantom Thief. Oh, uh, <laughs> apparently. <laughs> a little, little bit of Joker rubbing off on his cheek there. Mm. Yeah, <laughs> absolutely. Wow. Let's see if uh, both players are gonna stick to the characters from Game One. Probably should, honestly. That, that felt pretty, Can I just pretty good. Oh, okay. Uh, there we go. I was gonna say. Yeah. So back to this. Okay. Go game two between Kira Flats and Kira Nespers. Starting it's gonna be, it's just gonna be a very patient match in general. Absolutely. I feel like it's part partially the match and partially because they also just know each other pretty well. Yeah. Nice nair there, nair at a fair conversion by Kira Flex. For the most part, both these characters are very just no BS in this game. Does Pit For the most a, part. Does Pit have an option that hits below ledge? Uh, I think it's down for might. Okay. I can see his down smash as well, but that's more risky. It's so, sometimes you have to have like, such a good matchup knowledge in order to figure out what you want to do at ledge, so dropping down and dropping things back up. Oh, here we go. Another sheet combo string here. Try to follow up the ledge track. Is K9 going to be able to keep pure flex? Nope, not quite. Oh. Kira's able to get back center stage with a little assist from P9 all the way to the oh. other stage, that side of the stage. He's going for it. I don't blame him. Very oh. good pressure oh. coming up from him. Two up tilts in a row. From how did that, how that Nair hit him onto the platform? <laughs> and it, they had less than a percent as well. Wow. <laughs> oh! He almost got, got on there with a landing down air. Oh! Oh, oh no! Are no. we good? Oh. No, we're still good. He has wow. great recovery, and that was such a perfect angle there for Kira Flex. Kira Flex must have had enough uh, jump slot to get right in place for that. Kira's really good at recovering this character. Should be fair, a lot of time just holding an angle, Whoa, that still. Uh, K9 escorts Kira Flex oh. to the other side of the stage and secures the stock. Catches the jump right there. That's very nice from, from K9. Let's see how K9's going to try and. Uh, Almost got on the dash check. Extend this first stop. That dash is good in this game. I think it's really good at killing. Yeah. Oh, nice parry, but uh, Kira Flex not able to take advantage of it. And now he's at the receiving end of another, uh, I wasn't fair strain. Paltry fair strain, but an effective one nonetheless. Yeah. I mean, damage is damage. Yeah. Sometimes it doesn't have to be the most optimal punish in the world, but it's got to be something instead of just nothing, you know? Right. And since we're talking about character specific punish, it's a very good one. Oh, nice uh, rising fair there. Get him off that flash. ledge. Get him off the ledge. <laughs> but he's already taken 53% here on the second stock. He's down a game, too. So let's see how Kira plays this. That was interesting. 
I kind of love this. These are, honestly, I feel like a lot of people, like, if, if this is anyone else playing these characters, like, they just go in the, at that point, maybe go for, like, a grab. But these, these players know each other really well to the point where they know not to do an option like that, right? It's right. sort of, like, overextend too much. So nothing just happened there. They're just, like, yeah. kind of sending the shield playing neutral. And here's uh, another canine edge uh, ledge trap. Oh. Oh, Bakir gets out of it, though. And this should be a kill. Yeah. Fourth throw is so good. This fourth throw is very, very good. Combined with uh, Sheik's Light Weight, and here's the first stock. Now Get out of there. Two stocks apiece. Bakir has kind of kept it under 100, which means you have a relatively good chance of bringing things back. We saw Canine bring it back in game one, so let's see if Bakir is going to be able to do it here. Ooh, nice dash attack. Uses the threat of the fair to make Canine shield and goes into a gas grab. He is up a jump right now. Couldn't get much off that oh, though. Oh, nice jab. The rapid jab, okay. Oh, okay. Ooh, he tries to go for the reverse right there. He almost yeah. got that spike. If he got yeah. it, it would have definitely been dead, even if Canine could have beat again. Oh, really? Probably. Like, his pit uh, spike is not very powerful, but that, that percent probably could have done it. Okay. Like, I'm. But yeah. No, that was okay. Yeah. yeah we're commentators. Can embellish a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> this is kind of true, yeah. Now, let's see here. Dashing back and forth right now in neutral. Both players. Oh, oh just threw it out. Calm charging out of deals again. <laughs> Lost side beat by Jura Flax. Oh. 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 I thought it was going to upset. almost got caught right there. I thought it was going to upset right there. Yeah. Down air. A little bit of a scrum right now. Somebody yeah. able to get back on stage with stage control here. Cure Flex might have done it. Somebody knows too in this matchup that can that like here is doing really good at is just like he, he's always down being off stage because she loves to go for Neil's bouncing fish. Yeah. That's one of her best confirms. But you gotta do it in the air to get that. And it, and can just can't do that because because of, just because of the option uh, of Flex. Exactly. Yeah. Very smart matchup play there. Oh, almost it's the follow up right there off the tilt. Just K9. time, by the way. Oh my gosh, there's two yeah. minutes left. <laughs> it's a is, it, is a war of attrition. Good lord. If, if his clock doesn't get off soon, it could go to time. But who knows? Oh! oh. Got the backer, though. Speaking and, of which. And now K9 can kind of run away a little bit, maybe try and rack on squeeze damage for now. out the remaining two minutes or so we have left in this game, too. I don't think many players usually go for timeout in general when it comes to, when it comes to Smash, so I don't know if that'll happen. I don't, well, see can't, throw? I don't see Cannon's the first kill? to do that. That back throw's not a kill throw at all. Yes. And there, there we go. go. There's two right. The down smash, or down tilt, or that throw's down smash. That, that, was down, that was down tilt, actually. Ah, down tilt got on that ledge. Yeah, I did go the other side, so, yeah. Nice dash attack by Kira. He's now got the percentage lead, which might be really, oh. Sorry, I meant the I got the percentage lead. I was going to say. Oh, nice. I'm not fair still, but the fact that it's 3% is kind of sad to me. <laughs> Nice down air by the K9 get stage. He actually gets the oh, oh, drag down. Don't get anything though. Nope. Two percent for that one, I guess. Dash attack there. He actually gets stuff off of Sheik's down air in this game, which is pretty crazy. I've seen Void get like down air into uh, up smash, like tip up smash Whoa. before. This is nuts. In fact, it was, oh, they're grab. both like kill percent now. <laughs> All of a sudden, it's out of nowhere. <laughs> the, la the last minute or so, they, they started going a lot more on each other. So honestly, Right. Yeah, that's good. They're just hopping over one another right now. And now back aerials. to neutral, back to patient neutral. All right. Grab your canine. Oh. Is, oh, he almost that, had the balance That was a clutch nair. That was, that was going to be otherwise. Another nair there. You really need this right here. Oh. He needs yeah, something. He's down percentages too, so he really needs to make them 20% right now. Arrow. Grab. Oh, he's now got the percentage lead. <laughs> well, he's at least got that. Oh, About 20 tell. seconds left. Oh, another Nera shield. Oh, oh the bouncy fish oh, so almost close. got it. So close, but Karen really needs to present right seconds. now. 10 seconds left. 10, 9, 8, We should go with that. I'm not going to do it. All right. Uh, <laughs> and then 5, 4, 3, oh, man. 2. That's it. <laughs> GG. <laughs> GG. All right, can I taste it? Zero of the Cure Flax. 2-0. Sometimes it'd be like that. Especially when you have to play your room. Yep.